Hi viewers, today we are going to discuss about threaded binary tree. A binary tree is threaded by making all right side pointers that would normally be null point to the in order successor of the node and the all left side pointers that would normally be null point to the in order predecessor of the node. Now, now creation of binary tree, enter the root element 20, the address of the root, root node is 1000. Now enter the next element 15, the element 15 is smaller compared to the root node 20, so it is placed on the left side of the root and the left pointer of the root node points to the element 15. Now enter the next element 30. The element 30 is greater compared to the root node 20. So it is placed on the right side of root and the right pointer of the root node points to element 30. Now enter the next element 10. The element 10 is smaller compared to the root node 20 and it is smaller than element 15. And so it is placed on the left side of the element 15 and the left pointer of the element 15 points to element 10. Next, enter the next element 18. The element 18 is smaller compared to the root node 20, but it is greater than element 15. So it is placed on the right side of element 15 and the right pointer of the element 15 points to the element 18. Now enter the element 40. The element 40 is greater than compared to root node 20 and it is placed on the right side of the node 30 and the right pointer of the element 30 points to the element 40. Now the next is step threaded binary tree. Why we go for threaded binary tree? Binary trees have a lot of wasted space. The leaf nodes each have two null pointers. We can use these pointers to help us in order traversals. Threaded binary tree makes the tree traversal faster since we do not need stack or recursion for traversal. Now the in order traversal of the given binary tree is 10, 15, 18, 20, 30, 40. Now, the successor of element 10 is element 15. So, element 10's right null pointer is threaded to element 15. The predecessor of element 18 is element 15. So, element 18's left null pointer is threaded to element 15. The successor of element 18 is element 20. So element 18's right null pointer is threaded to element 20. The predecessor of element 30 is element 20. So element 30's left null pointer is threaded to element 20. The predecessor of element 40 is element 30. So element 40's left null pointer is threaded to element 30. The element 10 does not have a predecessor and element 40 does not have a successor. So we introduce a dummy node with its left pointer of the dummy node pointing to the root node. And the right pointer of the dummy node points to itself. Now the left null pointer of element 10 is threaded to dummy node. The right null pointer of element 40 is also threaded to the dummy node. 
So this is a full threaded binary tree. Thank you.